Once upon a time, there was an old man who used to go to the ocean to do his writing. He had a habit of walking on the beach every morning before he began his work. Early one morning, he was walking along the shore after a big storm had passed, and found the vast beach littered with starfish as far as the eye could see, stretching in both directions. Off in the distance, the old man noticed a small boy approaching. As the boy walked, he paused every so often, and as he grew closer, the man could see that he was occasionally bending down to pick up an object and throw it into the sea. The boy came closer still, and the man called out, Good morning! May I ask you what it is you're doing? The young boy paused, looked up, and replied, Throwing starfish into the ocean. The tide has washed them up onto the beach, and they can't return to the sea by themselves, the youth replied. When the sun gets high, they will die, unless I throw them back into the water. The old man replied, but there must be tens of thousands of starfish on this beach. I'm afraid you won't really be able to make much of a difference. The boy bent down, picked up yet another starfish, and threw it as far as he could into the ocean. Then he turned, smiled, and said, It made a difference to that one. So I've actually never heard this story until a short while ago because of Markiplier, but it really stuck with me. Now, for those who don't know the meaning of this story, it basically means that it doesn't matter how little you do, every little thing you do matters. You may not think it's worth the effort, hell, you might think, what does it matter, I'm barely making a difference, but you are. You can always make a difference. There are a lot of people here at Fanfickle and we all love doing what we're doing here. We're coming up on two years of doing this soon, and we want to keep going for many years to come. But for that to be possible, it's time to face the facts that we can't rely on YouTube ad revenue alone. Especially since there's over 15 people in the group. We are close to 7,000 subscribers. 7,000. That is a lot of people who want to see our content, and that starfish theory really got me thinking. All we ask from all of you is a dollar. Now think about that for a minute. A single dollar. If all of you gave us just one dollar, we'd be pretty much set. And that brings us to the launch of our Patreon. Now, of course, if you contribute more than that, not only would we be ever so grateful for your generosity, but you would also be getting some sweet perks as well. One dollar not only gets our eternal gratitude, but you also get your name permanently plastered onto the end cards of our video. $5 is a pretty good one, because if you're in the Fickle Family Discord group, then your name gets to be all shiny and silver as you're given the title of Patron. Not only that, but you're also entered into a raffle to win a free art commission from Cadet Redshirt. You might have seen her pop up from time to time on FanPickle. She's been handling a lot of the art for the channel, including the artwork for the Battle of the Mages cover and the newest version of Hipsto. She does fantastic artwork, and the longer you remain in the raffle, the larger your chances are of winning the next one. $10. Now this one is where things get interesting. You see, we here at Fanfickle have a lot of ideas that we want to do, but for the most part, we're usually extremely busy to flesh out these ideas. So this is where you can come in. This is the request and suggestion raffle. Why are we raffling suggestions? Because honestly, this is the only way we can think of everyone getting their voices in eventually without them turning into just noise. Same rules apply for the $5 raffle, and yes, you enter that one as well if you pay for this tier. $15, however, if you don't want to wait for a raffle and just want to suggest something simple for us to do, then go up an extra $5 to the $15 tier. This one will let you suggest a short comic dub. These will be prioritized over the suggestion raffles for the most part because they'll be easy to make, as well as letting you enter previous raffles as well. However, Unlike the raffles, you're not picked at random. Instead, just keep paying the $15 a month to suggest a new short comic for us to dub. There are also two more payment tiers, but they're just joke tiers. Just ignore those. We don't expect anyone to do those. They're just there for the lulls. So, there you have it. We got a Patreon now. Feel free to pay whatever you want, but just remember, $1 is just as important as a single starfish thrown back into the ocean.